two of competition in Starch Madness brought to you by Accidentally Derivative. We move on to the domestic sweet division and uh, our sort of regional uh, uh, victors here are the Bischoff uh, uh, cookies, cookie sweet crackers, whatever you want to call these. These are very strange texture, but, but uh, very, very yummy. Uh, and they're going against the mint Oreos over there. That's uh, you may hold it up if you, if you wanted. Mm-hmm. 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 Um, you 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 said regional though. I, what region would you associate well, with the? Like, uh, not necessarily. These are from a region. You mean like but, the North know, American region? In that uh, domestic savory is a region. Oh, domestic sweet okay. is a region. Uh, I got it. Yeah. Okay. Um, I think we should. I don't know what we should start. I think the Biscoff. Probably. Yeah, let's start with the Biscoff. Now, yeah. these, uh, these are coming in the little sort of... Lotus, since Lotus. 1932 Biscoff. And coffee. you would normally eat these with some tea or coffee. Tea or coffee. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. And do you, feel like, do you feel like we're making a bad decision not having tea or coffee when we are... I think that perhaps these? for uh, 2022's Starch Madness, coffee We should have the proper a, accompaniment. Uh, yeah. Like dealer's choice. I, get, I could have tea if I wanted and you could have coffee and... Mmm, I love the cinnamon smell. Oh, man. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's like, even beyond cinnamon, it's like a little, I don't know if it's allspice or if it's nutmeg. I mean, there's some kind of other sort of Christmassy type spice in there, too. Christmassy. But really good. That's a sort good of a ginger ready too, kind of maybe. It is like a little crispy, it's like a Christmassy snack. It is very Christmassy. It's a Christmas, it's a crispy Christmassy snack. Mm -hmm. Lotus, you can use that if you want to. Mmm. I know you're watching. Get rid of the Biscoff part, though. I don't understand that. Oh, that's good. That's somebody's name, I think. I'm just going to keep eating it. Mm-hmm. Mmm. 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 I'm just really enjoying it. Mm-hmm. Mine was a little fractured, and I had some shrapnel in there. Oh, look. Mine looks like a little temple. A little church, maybe. Or, or a yeah. school. Or a school. And there's a steeple. Um, and I was Pop it in your mouth and you kill all the people. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, don't do it. <laughs> I think we're delving into some interesting parts of Jason's psyche here. <laughs> oh. That starts madness for you. Hmm. Okay. All yeah. right. So we got a good. Uh, now that I've officially destroyed and eaten the village, <laughs> we can move let's, on. Uh, let's see. What you can do to the countryside and the, the mint. Mm. Mm. Mint Oreos. Resealable packaging, which is nice. Oreo has got it going on when it comes with resealable packaging. Mm. I don't know why everything doesn't use that method of package sealing. So good. I'm taking two. You take two. Is that okay? Please Should do. I just take one? No, we'll take two. Okay. I'll take I'll take two then as well. Chuck. Mm. Mm -hmm. Thanks, Chuck. Oh, All right. You managed to rip it somehow. Rolling up my sleeves for this one because I mean business. Two cookies. All right. Do we do a twist on this one or do we do we? Now, what I do is I jam the whole thing in my mouth and then I slowly push down and move my tongue, my uh, my teeth back and forth so that it squishes the the innards out the outside, and it's, I don't know. It's that lovely. was really weird. That's the way I do it. That's so weird. Can you, we need like an animation or something of that. <laughs> That's a lot of cookie to like. We don't have the budget for that. Mm. 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 That's a damn fine Oreo. <laughs> I'm not on, I'm not a big Oreo fan. For the record. And then tell you this evokes. I'm gonna eat I'm gonna eat just the Oreo part, like the Oh yeah. Is there no, any I don't like that part. No, I don't like it. This by itself, not a winner. So there's no mint at all in the in the cookies. I wouldn't expect so, but you never know. No. They went for um, au natural. Yeah, they're just you know repurposing the regular mm -hmm. Oreo cookie for that. So all the goodness on this is really and the mint. The, the mint chocolate, or the mint uh, filling. Mm. 
Right. Well, you can say that. Sorry. No, go. please. Without the Oreo cookie part, it's not the same. It does not as good. You have to have them both. It's like just too sweet and mm -hmm. almost not as minty. Hmm. That's we it's weird. Something in the cookie brings, brings out, the mint. out the mint. That's genius. And it is quite genius. Yeah. Right. Now, I tell you, there are a lot of different kinds of mint cookies and things out there. How do they do that? These evoke those uh, the thin mints from the uh, from the Girl Scouts mm -hmm. a the, lot. The proper ones. Right, right. The, the real ones mm -hmm. from the. Mm -hmm. I don't remember which which. The ones we get here are not. Not yet. No. Mm -hmm. now, and w w where do you think the cutoff is on that? It's like, weird. It's a weird geography. There's a whole map. It's a whole map mm -hmm. apparently. I don't know. We'll well, look that up, put it in show notes. Oh no, I know what I want. All right. So what, where are we going? I'm gonna get some more. Oreo, mint Oreo, mint Oreos. Mint Oreos. Mint Oreos. Mint Oreos. And I have to say, I also agree. Mint Oreos uh, takes this round I mean, it's delicious. rather handily. These things are awesome. <laughs> these are they wonderful. Are awesome. <laughs> but they went up against these guys. Yeah. And that's... If they'd just gone up against traditional Oreos, they would never would have made... I mean... I, I can't... Mm -mm. I mean, these, 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 these are a contender for can you imagine making what they're, it to the championship. Can you imagine what they're going to be like with milk? Oh, no. oh, see these with milk versus those with coffee. Mm -hmm. Man, now that's that would be a matchup, right? A nice there. little side bet, maybe on that one. Yeah, I have to, I have to look a little. Not that we're so, betting. We uh, not at all. We do not condone that at all. I'll pay you later, Chuck. Yeah, it's good to do it. Okay. Um, so, Mitch. Oreos takes this round against the Bischoff cookies from Lotus. So uh, there you have it, and we'll see which one goes to the final four. Come in, well, we know which one's going to the final four, and we'll see it again in the final four right here on Starch Madness by Accidentally Derivative. Keep it right here for more great round two action coming up tomorrow. Or if tomorrow's a weekend, then Monday. See you then. There is no tomorrow. That's what I believe.